Kaza means uh, communities in harmony with nature. Kaza means people appreciating the God-given gifts that we have. It's a good example uh, how countries could work together. It's for us a good example uh, where we can support it to development. Somos fortes e invencíveis. We are strong and invincible. Quando lutamos unidos. When we are together. Fracos e derrotados. Weak and uh, Defeated. When we are divided. When we are divided. Então unidos como só homem. So united. Vamos levantar a África Austral. We have to. E vamos concretizar os nossos sonhos. And realize our dreams. Coming together of your five countries to jointly manage this great transfrontier conservation area is a true symbol of regional integration. I see the transfrontier conservation areas as development model that integrates poverty reduction, sustainable management of natural resources and regional integration and transforms them into the improvement of our human capital into wealth creation. And our kids, our kids' kids are going to come. We want them to find this natural beauty in the state we found it. And that, I think, is the greatest gift to mankind. Botswana has the highest number of elephants in the world. Uh, these elephants are not really ours. They come from our neighboring countries. And therefore, extending that range would help with the redistribution of the elephant population. We believe that for conservation efforts to be effective, establishment of transboundary wildlife corridors transboundary law enforcement operations, joint wildlife population surveys, and promotion of compatible land use practices. And we are not under any illusion all these are easy to achieve. Casa to us means conservation, the preservation of our natural heritage, which comprises uh, wildlife, natural resources, and the communities that live within those areas. The existence of land mining represent, sem dúvida, represent without doubting o grande desafio, the big challenge que deve ser vencido, that need to be defeated a todo custo, with all the effort para viabilizar, to viabilize a implementação do projeto Casa. the implementation of the CASA project.
Causa is a, incredibly innovative. It's looking at things at a much greater scale than people are used to looking for. This park is unique. It involves five different countries with different interests in their economic development. But however, they've decided to use natural resources and tourism as a tool for development. It's a very ambitious project. If you think about it, the scale, it's enormous. Um, and, and a lot of people thought that this, this is a pipe dream. This is something that cannot really become a reality because it's so enormous. So we came from different backgrounds with different interests. The first thing we had to do was to be friends as ministers. Unless we appreciate those cultural diversity, then there's no tourism to speak of. And unless there's that respect amongst these five countries, there is no casa. Now, this conference was important because we are trying to harmonize the policies in individual states. The differences in the policy and legal statutes have made the fight against transboundary environmental crimes in the region a difficult task. These challenges will soon be a thing of the past. I would really like to commend the five governments that have come together, the vision that they've demonstrated to f formulate CASA. A time when CASA can really be seen as number one tourist destination in the region, if not in the continent. The choice need to uh, be convinced that it's uh, an additional um, um, advantage to uh, go from one country to the other. Casa means there are no boundaries, but I have to go through five borders to come here. We would like to support the five Casa nations in establishing maybe a, a joint visa. We are also looking at a Casa which can become a conference site uh, whereby the five partner countries could be able to jointly host big international conferences. Here, the first international function in Kaza, it will be Kaza hosting the United Nations World Tourism Organization General Assembly. What happened here with the launch of Kaza is significant. Um, if you think about it, 25 years ago, uh, there used to be civil wars in some of these countries. Um, up to 10 years ago, there was still a civil war in Angola. Uh, that things could have changed so dramatically, I think sends a powerful message across the world. Casa is a community program. So the fact that the communities, the traditional leaders, the five governments have agreed to work together, that is very the strength of Casa. Poverty um, eradication is a key, rural development is key. So we really target the local communities. The resources are there for them and they should be well guarded and guarded jealously. But it will also impact positively in the whole five countries. Our responsibility is to ensure that community aspirations are met. We must give our community the right to use those resources and benefit from them. Through that, they are in a better position to preserve our biodiversity. Today, as we launch the CASA, we are saying we are bringing hope, we are bringing respect, we are bringing harmony and love for wildlife. But at the end of the day, the communities must benefit from what we set to do. However, now we have to come to uh, investment really in, in the spot to have something which is uh, to be seen. I have a dream that we can fight poverty, we can defeat poverty. We can use conservation, we can use proper management of our resources 
to bring them back and to use them as a tool for fighting poverty. Ambitious idea of regional integration, which is meaningful with uh, 200 million population uh, living in the same, uh, going in the same direction. For the German government, it's one of the most uh, effective and uh, most uh, valuable projects that we are supporting here. There is big potential uh, of, of and need uh, to do much more than we are uh, doing right now. Uh, we'll be in the position to contribute more funds to the Casa region this year. So we are really looking forward to uh, a further development of tourism and the empowerment of the population in these five countries. It sends a powerful message across the world to say that this concept uh, of cooperation, of peace, um, is, which transcends boundaries, is, is tremendously powerful and could be a real model and showcase for the rest of the world.